In mathematical notation for numbers, sign digit representation is a positional system with sign digits. The representation may not be unique. Sign digit representation can be used to accomplish fast addition of integers because it can eliminate chains of dependent carries. In the binary numeral system, a special case sign digit representation is the non-adjacent form, which can offer speed benefits with minimal space overhead. Challenges in calculation stimulated early authors Colson and Corchy to use sign digit representation. The further step of replacing negated digits with new ones was suggested by Selling and Kajori. Balanced form. In balanced form, the digits are drawn from a range to, where typically, for balanced forms, odd base numbers are advantageous. With an odd base number, truncation and rounding become the same operation, and all the digits except zero are used in both positive and negative form. A notable example is balanced ternary, where the bases and the numerals have the values minus one, zero and plus one. Balanced ternary uses the minimum number of digits in a balanced form. Balanced decimal uses digits from minus 5 to plus 4. Balanced base 9, with digits from minus 4 to plus 4 provides the advantages of an odd base balanced form with a similar number of digits, and is easy to convert to and from balanced ternary. Other notable examples include Boole encoding and non-adjacent form, both of which use abasive, and both of which use numerals with the values minus 1, 0, and plus 1, non-uniqueness. Note that sign digit representation is not necessarily unique. For instance, 2 equals 4 plus 2 plus 1 equals 7 2 equals 8 minus 2 plus 1 equals 7 2 equals 8 minus 4 plus 2 plus 1 equals 7 2 equals 8 minus 1 equals 7 The non-adjacent form does guarantee a unique representation for every integer value, as do balanced forms. When representations are extended to fractional numbers, uniqueness is lost for non-adjacent and balanced forms. For example, consider the following repeating binary numbers in NAF. 2 equals 2 thirds equals 2 in the balanced form repeating decimals 10 equals 4 ninths equals 10 such examples can be shown to exist by considering the greatest and smallest possible representations with integral parts 0 and 1 respectively, and then noting that they are equal. In written and spoken language, the oral and written forms of numbers in the Punjabi language use a form of a negative numeral 1 written as una or un. This negative 1 is used to form 19, 29, 89 from the root for 20, 30, 90. Explicitly, here are the numbers. 19 uni, 20 vih, 21 icky, 29 una t, 30 tih, 31 icka t, 39 untala, 40 chali, 41 ik tali, 49 unanja, 50 panja, 51 ik vanja, 59 under hat, 60 sath, 61 a car hat, 69 unatar, 70 satar, 71 ik atar. 79 on Asi, 80 Asa, 81 Ikiasi, 89 on Anva, 90 Nab, 91 Ikanavan. In 1928, Florian Kajori noted the recurring theme of signed digits, starting with Colson and Korchi. In his book History of Mathematical Notations, Kajori titled the section Negative Numerals. Edward Selling advocated inverting the digits 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5 to indicate the negative sign. He also suggested Sny, Jess, Judd, Breath, and Niff as names to use vocally. Most of the other early sources used a bar over a digit to indicate a negative sign through it. For completeness, Colson uses examples and describes addition, multiplication and division using a table of multiples of the divisor. He explains the convenience of approximation by truncation in multiplication. Colson also devised an instrument that calculated using signed digits.